You're going to listen back to this and realize how ridiculous you sound. This is an after school program podcast. Game of Church Stories. What key are we in? G? Yeah. <laughs> Did you say Game of Church Stories? <laughs> So All right. Official. How you doing, man? Oh, we're just doing this thing. Oh, yeah, we're doing this thing, dude. Oh, yeah, I don't know who you, what podcast you thought this was. <laughs> <laughs> but there's, <laughs> there's nothing off the top. No. <laughs> there's no conversation beforehand. <laughs> there's no prep. There's no planning. There's no, like, hey, for so for today's show, the show just kind of starts. You re- yeah. Record. Here we go. Really yeah. Uh, I was just talking to Chase about that. I was like, this is a pretty sweet gig. We don't do any prep. No. And we just. No. Riff. And it lasts for an hour <laughs> yeah. every time. <laughs> and it's consistently about the same time every time, too. Yeah. yeah. And wild. honestly, like, we really, uh, well, we've been on your podcast, but we've, you've done yeah, it on ours. Right? Yeah. Uh, that was fun. Yeah, it's just a one of a kind, man. This I, is... love, I love your friendship with Chase, how that just kind of butted. Yeah. Because he's hilarious. He's really funny. He was a uh, freshman at North Greenville when I was a senior. Mm. And, dude, he was on the improv team. And those improv shows were insane. Like, yeah. He's, yeah. He's crazy. He is, man. He is really funny. He's it, like the opposite of improv energy, too. Right, yeah. <laughs> Which, improv energy is like dudes with flannel and glasses. <laughs> yeah, that, that bother me. <laughs> improv people annoy me. I think it's because, like, uh, stand-ups. I've heard you say that so, Yeah, are just kind of, like, mean. Yeah. And, uh... I don't know, what it is, but it's like the bubbly, like, all right, I'm going to need a, I'm going to need a, a name of a town. <laughs> Give me, the, the, I don't want to slap them sometimes. Give me, Pickens, uh, <laughs> Pickens County. And you're like, all right, the suggestion is Pickens County. And you're like, all right, this half of the room, can I get you to clap? <laughs> all right, this, yeah. t- this is half of the room. Woo. You know, I hate it. Um, oh, but I mean, that being said, I, there are some improvisers that I love and that I think are amazing. Yeah. And Middle Ditch and Schwartz. We just watched yeah. that. And I dubbed you. I was like, I, I wish I knew a, sh- a Paul, a short Paul. But then I was like, oh, yeah, the baby picture of PD. I was like, that's short Man, Paul. <laughs> you know why I hate an improv? Because I was bad at it when I took a class. Did, I think were you really? Like, yeah, an improv I think class? that's the root of me hating on it. I I <laughs> I didn't know because you did a class. And I, I was like, anybody. dude, let me know when you do your showcase. And you're like, oh, you already did it. And I was like, well, why didn't you tell anyone? I we wanted like, to be there. I want to make sure I'm good at this before I invite people. See... I've got this running note on my phone yeah. that I add like things to that could be used in a stand up set. Yeah. And I've never done a stand up set, but I always like think, hey, I'm going to psych myself up to do it one day. But I'm not going to tell anybody because if it sucks, I don't want to. Can I say sucks on this? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yes. All right. Sorry. So I'll to beef if it, it out. If it's trash, <laughs> yeah. then I'm just like going to pretend it didn't happen. Mm-hmm. Well, I think that's the. Uh, I got too many notes on my phone. <laughs> Me too. Uh, and bad ones. It's just right. Some of them yeah, are it's like something bad. that I think is funny, and then I'll listen back and be like, what? I just, I just sound dumb. It's right. also like funny, like at a specific context. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean, like I'll say something when I'm hanging around with people. And I'm like, this is hilarious. But then I'll read it back and I'm like, banana shoes. Right. <laughs> what was... Why was I trying to... This was like around Christmas 2017. <laughs> what did I have that I thought was so important <laughs> that I that I wrote it down? And that's the whole note. But that's the whole note. Yeah. The, I don't even... Sometimes I won't even write the whole joke. I'll think of something. And, then, right, I'll, like, and then I'll be like, all right, up. I'm going to write like a keyword that'll remind me <laughs> later what I just thought of. And it'll be like, did you know Hillary Clinton Island or something <laughs> right. like that. <laughs> and I'll be like, and I'll, then I'll go back and I'll have no idea what that means. That's the worst. <laughs> so I've been trying. I don't know, man. I still, if I don't like write, I'll try to write down like more meat and potatoes of uh-huh. a thing at a time. Um, but yeah, I feel like we were going to write notes for this podcast. We just <laughs> never got around to it. We yeah. have a shared note open for the record. If anybody <laughs> asks, we've thought about yes. being more prepared. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, okay. Uh, shoot, let's get into it. Uh, hey, my name is Shama, and um, my wife is on drugs because she got her wisdom teeth pulled yeah. <laughs> today. Uh, my name is PD, and I'm back, baby. <laughs> I'm recovered. PD has been on drugs, you? recovering, right? <laughs> yeah. uh, Whatever actually, you're doing well, right I, now, if you just can't, applaud I'd be the man who beat Mono in like a week and a half. <laughs> yeah, they told me two weeks. And it only took me like five days. So <laughs> take move that, over, doctors. Destiny's Child. We have a yeah. new survivor. Uh, I've got the papers. <laughs> my liver is doing great now. <laughs> when you told me yesterday, you were like, my liver and a spleen are looking a lot better. I was like, <laughs> how are major organs involved in a kissing disease? <laughs> but now, if anybody touches me, I go, my spleen. <laughs> <laughs> Does it? Did it hurt like last week? 
Uh, if I would like try to do too much, like if I ran up the stairs or something, I would feel like a sharp pain. Well, I'm sorry I made you do a podcast. Oh no, it's all. I was in my bed. Okay. Like, I, was, <laughs> I recorded that podcast laying down. I don't want people to think like I care so much about content <laughs> that I'm like, oh you, oh okay, oh you're bedridden, dope. Well, we're gonna put this out with you or without you. I was also like, I want to address this. Yeah. If I, because they told me like I could be bedridden for four months. Right. So. Yeah. I was thinking, like, I have no idea when this is going to be over. And, I mean, it ended up only being less than a week, but... <laughs> you made it through, man. Yeah. Um, when you texted me this morning, yeah, I was like, it's been like, it's not been that long. Like, is he good? Are we, I was a zombie. Are we going to do this? I was like a straight up zombie for four days. I was just walking around the house like, uh... Right. I, I knew that things were bad when I laughed probably like day five or something my mom's like oh you just laughed i haven't heard you laugh in a while and that's when you realize you're like oh no yeah <laughs> who have i been just a zombie walking around you were i called you the other day so i dropped off four tubs of a uh, little ice cream <laughs> nice and then afterwards I, I i called you and i was like hey I left something on your porch man it's imperative you pick it up right now and then a couple days later you're like yeah i'm supposed to stay away from sugar and i'm like why are you <laughs> It's like I just dropped off like just ga- just gallons yeah, but do you of. You remember sugar. what I told you? Yeah. Then you were like, "Yeah, I've actually just been micro dosing the ice cream." <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, just a little, like a spoon just before a I go spoonful. to bed. Yeah. You just chop it up with a credit card. <laughs> and you're like, I'll just like find where the cookie dough is and I like, scoop like, it up and like, that's my bite for, for the day. <laughs> yeah. So you'll be done with it in like what 2026? <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> if Mono proceeds, yeah. uh, it, I guess we was, should introduce rough, our guest. Rough. Who's yeah, good now? All right been sitting between us and I'm talking so sorry <laughs> yeah no that's us man where is blame the host yeah. hey that's, that's how we do this thing <laughs> our guest is um friend of the show yes you long time uh, listener first time been in yeah. one video you've two, been in a music video or, tr- uh yes uh, jingle bells remix right and played the uh, role of you awkward in, youth pastor <laughs> were you in press conference? no my no, sister was oh, she okay. was an extra yeah yeah, yeah. I think he That's heard fun. about it, but he was like, oh, I'm not going to be in some stupid student <laughs> film. Yeah. I had a I had a thing that day. I don't oh, know what okay. it was. And that doesn't help the cause right now. <laughs> but it's, it, it was a real was, thing. It was more important than what we did. Right. Yeah. Um, sure. And uh, you you work for a church. I do. Yep. You also do a podcast called Steeple People. Uh-huh. Yep. Uh, and we've shared, we were on your podcast. We've also done a swap cast where we yeah. shared uh, P- Steeple People here. Mm-hmm. Uh, go check that out. We'll link it in the, in the show notes. Um, guys. JG, you just go by JG, right? Yep, JG That's Falk. Me. Welcome to the show, F-A-U-L-K. man. F A U L K. Yeah, I moved recently, so I've been having to spell it a lot over the phone. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Set, setting up the Wi Fi and just the power. It? And you're just used to it. Uh, yeah, right. I, all I do, it's at a point now. I don't even say my name if I'm <laughs> talking to anybody in an office. Right. It's just like, can I get a first name last name? I'm like M R E M A E L I S H A M A. And they're like, did you? They're like, I'm not. It's not even worth I, saying. I it. do that too. I'll it's be not like, worth saying it. Bachman. B A C H M A N N. Bachman. <laughs> ding 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 ding. Yeah. You win a spelling bee. <laughs> Come on down. Oh man, well, this has been good, man. Uh, I love how I'm saying this has been good. That's the end of the show. I was gonna say we're done. Show. Is that, we're done. We're wrapping it up. <laughs> we did. It's Get out of here. Um, so JG, you are a uh, local Greenville guy, right? Yeah. Were you born mm-hmm. and raised in like the area? I was born and raised in Charlotte. Charlotte, uh, Belmont, down. to be specifically. Okay, so, to be. Specific. Yeah. <laughs> Words are hard. Hey, dude, listen. You specific. saw how we just started the yeah. show. Grammar doesn't matter. Too specific. Grammar doesn't specific. matter. Right. Um, so right now you work for a church. Are you, and what, what is your role at the church? Um, so my title is intern. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that just means doer of all things. Right. Yeah. A little bit, yeah. Um, I like to say jack of all trades. Yeah. People like to finish with master of none, and I'm <laughs> like, like, no, 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 no. I'm I mean, good at some. Yeah. I, yeah, Jack but, of all trades, Aziz Ansari. <laughs> yes. <laughs> hey, that's good. Uh, well, that's good, man. But uh, yeah, I work with students and kids, and um, right now I'm doing our online service stuff. I, I, let me so. let me say one thing. <laughs> Everyone's doing the yeah. online service, right? Let well, I'm, say, I'm the one compiling, is what I'm saying. Oh yeah. gosh, man. Yeah. God bless you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> is Murphy's Law like like right at work? Everything that can go wrong goes wrong. Yes. Yeah. Right. Uh, man. <laughs> Man, um, yeah, I've been seeing a lot of lives, a lot of ads on Instagram for <laughs> watch us. You can join us now, and I'm like, maybe, maybe. right? Maybe not. 
empty I'm, the, the empty arena church is this <laughs> I've, I've been i've been complaining about empty arena professional wrestling right and it's the same for sure it's like it's depressing <laughs> yeah it's like so good to see uh yeah um it's good to be here yeah <laughs> it's like no we're I'm not, i can't get over that you're not supposed to be in an empty room yeah. right yeah is yeah and it's just like a it's reminder that we're in a pandemic too so communal that all of a sudden now you're like uh no i'm up here now and uh you'll see this on sunday <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> or whenever you decide to watch it right man, man have you seen the churches that are putting like pictures of oh yeah, yeah they're like cutting the out and stuff? members and they're like oh, taping, oh, taping them, them to the chairs yeah. or pews so or whatever at least you have some type of eye line yeah. to it's look like, at, like <laughs> extra depressing right <laughs> <laughs> oh man dude uh Man, so you also went to North Greenville University. I did, yeah. Keep on doing it. Am I supposed to name drop stuff? Yeah. And, and you're the leader of the NGU um, protest for the stay-at-home orders. <laughs> uh, I'm no, confused. No, no, no. <laughs> Is that because I'm here and not at my home? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I just you... wanted to say that you were leading a protest <laughs> okay, against right, the stay-at-home yeah. orders. <laughs> I just read, we just read an article. It's like the guy who uh, is the headed up... Uh, uh, reopened North Carolina, just yeah. got COVID-19. Oh so yeah. anyways, and I'm like, we're announcing dude, come that we're on. joining the uh, NGU alumni. Nice. Even though we're not alumni, yeah. we're joining the alumni <laughs> protest <laughs> right. for the stay-at-home orders. I'm, uh, <laughs> people always ask me, they're like, oh, people just assume that I went to NGU. And I'm yeah, like, right. I did not. Well, Because you say things like small Christian college, uh, right outside Greenville. Yeah, yeah. It's like, that's how we describe ourselves. I, uh, but but. It, <laughs> I went to a smaller Christian college. Right, yeah. I should just say, I went to a tiny Christian college with like 60 people. Right. <laughs> My graduating class was like four dudes. <laughs> um, but yeah, what did you graduate with from NGU? So it was called Interdisciplinary Studies. Okay. I don't know if you've heard of it, but it just means that I took like three different majors and put them together. So you're like ready for anything. You could be a missionary or like... Master of none. <laughs> 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 missionary or master of done you know so one thing that i will say uh talking to you right now is i and having married grace i realize that uh there are so many cool people in greenville that i feel like i just met <laughs> right and yeah. part of me i'm like really mad because i'm like we've been in the same city this whole time right and my wife's been in the same city and i worked in tr and like whatever yeah and i'm like we could have known each but i guess it's all you know for the good sure but uh in a way it's kind of weird because i'm like i don't know did we should we all have gone to north greenville and right. uh, even then we probably wouldn't well, have even cared for each other so. yeah the, to, to reference chase again <laughs> um i was like i think he, he was talking about how lame so many of them are. And yeah. I was like, I guess my view is skewed because all I know is like, like I know JG people. and Marley and right. Chase and Abby, yeah. all people I like. You know, a lot of really cool people from my yeah. family. Yeah. And you're like, yeah, yeah. And I don't. So I tell people, uh, it's like I went to NGU. Like I've made so many like connections. Uh -huh. So it's like I went without the debt, right? <laughs> without the student loans. Yes. Uh, so, you know, it's like yeah. the same thing. But yeah, man, it's, thanks for thanks for joining us. I, hey, glad to be here. You, you're a bold man. <laughs> <laughs> you're a bold man. Midst of COVID nineteen, you're sitting next to a man who just beat just, mono. Yeah, yeah. Mono. <laughs> but apparently his uh, saliva is still toxic for like a year. <laughs> That's the crazy part. Is like, the, the, don't share anything with me ever, okay? man. Yeah. So I mean, Lauren is compromised. Because I've had this for like six weeks. Oh, oh. You, Wait a second. Uh, you, you have it for weeks and you don't know. Uh, That's, yeah. You only experience symptoms after like week number six. Did hmm. she get tested? No, she hasn't. She should. <laughs> <laughs> I thought she's just going about life. Yeah. What she's, do you What do you do? Like, what do they? What do you do for mono? Take it. <laughs> do, we just, do, we, do we just start like a Michael Scott fun run for mono? It's not what you do. You just, you're in pain. <laughs> Whatever you do, don't be in any med. Don't be a medical professional. Because people are going to come up to you with so many problems. You're going to be like, uh, I don't know. Deal with write it. this I'm one out, write, buddy. I'm going to write deal with it on this piece of paper and bill you seven thousand dollars. How does that sound? I could not do anything without being like extremely fatigued. 
Yeah. And then I was having to take ibuprofen because my throat hurt so bad. Yeah. And then eventually, like, taking two ibuprofen wasn't enough. My throat still hurt. So then I popped, like, four of them one mm, time. Yes. And then my kidneys hurt. And I was like, <laughs> crap. Can't do that anymore. So, I'm upset the balance in the force. Let me let me say this. I, I, love, I love the Lord. Let me start off by saying that. <laughs> but I was telling my wife the other day while we were walking in the, in the afternoon. And I was like, look, like, I love, I love life and I love you. And I love good health, but I'm like, the moment that is compromised, <laughs> I was like, I want you to know that I'm just going to get my affairs in order. <laughs> yeah. Like if I got a bad diagnosis or whatever, like I, I I'm going to fight, but at the same time, <laughs> I'm just going to get stuff in order. You know, yeah. it's like nothing yeah, it's is guaranteed case. after that. Right. Like, and I also like, I hate cancer. I lost a dad to cancer, uh, a dad, my dad to cancer. So, uh, so I'm like, you know, it's, it's just you, once you start trusting professionals, <laughs> it's, uh, it's, it's downhill. <laughs> yeah. well, that's what I call it a practice, right? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. You're never doing medicine. You're right. practicing I'm medicine. I'm practicing medicine. Like, I don't know. I'll be back. I'm working a 14-hour shift. Who knows? I don't know. Yeah. See you later. But when I said you just take it, that's basically all the doctors. <laughs> like, I, w- I was expecting to be given some kind of like, all right, you're not going to feel anything. Here's right. A pill that, yeah, you're going to feel fine. That, no. It's just like Nurse, give me a mono and, shot. <laughs> incredibly painful for like... Four days, and then I was like, "Oh, is this how my life is going to be for a couple months?" <laughs> oh my god, that's what they made it seem like. Right? Me. Yeah. And then, like the next day, I was like, "Oh, wait, it's going away. Why is it going away? They, they, they I've been misled, <laughs> man. I don't know, dude. Hey, you're on the other side, though. Yeah. Hey, I, I told you it's nice TV. knowing you, but you know, it's 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 nice to know you now. Like yeah. now that you're healthy, I, I was <laughs> like, nice I'm not. I want to watch you. comedy. I don't want to enjoy something right yeah. now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was watching yeah, the NFL Dutch draft for three days. <laughs> All right, I saw some of the draft. Hey, we're all Twitter buddies. Yeah, <laughs> right. I love keeping up with you guys. I'm only friends with like five real people on Twitter. Yeah. Uh, and I see you guys on the timeline a lot. Yeah, <laughs> I've, I've, I've definitely like upped my my Twittering. Yeah. I, I saw Chase on campus a few weeks back before everything shut down. I was up there for a thing, and um, he was like, "Hey, man, what's up?" And I was like. I think this is the first time we've actually talked in person. He was like, yeah, but we're Twitter friends. <laughs> I was like, it means, uh, yeah, that all right, means cool. everything. That yeah. means the world. Right. <laughs> and before I felt like I was just tweeting into a void. Right. And it's like the first time it doesn't feel that way anymore. Yeah, like yeah. people actually respond. Yeah. I mean, it's, I don't know what Twitter is. I didn't mind tweeting into <laughs> a void know. either. I'm old school. I like Facebook. <laughs> I trash. <laughs> so I'll go on Facebook, but then I'll trash Facebook on Twitter. Right. <laughs> But then still go back to fa- <laughs> so a part of me I'm like uh, I'm, 20, I, I'm 28. Let me say that I'm 28. That's that's, that's what, when you're in your late 20s. That's what you do. I'm out on Facebook. <laughs> I, I just can't. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Well, God bless you. I love you, and we miss you. Me and all the <laughs> 70 year olds. Me and all the geriatrics miss you. <laughs> the geriatric millionaires. <laughs> Dude, I was driving in and I was trying to find your house. And yeah. There's some really nice houses up the street. Oh, thanks. And I was like, I need to get a, my- get a deal with Veggie Tales or do the Dave Ramsey thing. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> somebody put this ridiculous. So you talk about that man, like that four yeah. car garage right. monstrosity. <laughs> It was one of those things. I mean, I live in an okay neighborhood. You're, you're talking me you up. Have it, you have stuck. a nice house. Yeah. I mean, it's it's okay. Uh, <laughs> I rent it. Uh, so I was talking. Uh, no, no, no. Somebody built this huge house over here. Yeah. Which at first I was like, oh, is it going to be like a, I don't know, some type of store <laughs> or something in the we middle got a of like dinner, a y'all. subdivision? And no, it's just somebody's house. And they just pull in with like Audis and like Rovers. And oh I'm my like, gosh. Okay. Why? <laughs> but welcome to the neighborhood. What are you hiding? Yeah. Why here? Yeah. <laughs> what are you hiding, Jeff Bezos? <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. Dude, I, I do go to church with a guy who looks Jeff like Je- Jeff. Je- Jeff, like- Jeff like Jeff Bezos. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff like just, he looks just like Jeff Bezos. Um, and apparently he gets that so much that even I thought I was, I was like, surely he d- does he? He doesn't know. Yeah. And I was like, does anybody? He's like, I get it all the time. It's like people will stop me at restaurants. <laughs> And then he did like the like he like squinted one eye, and I was like, God, ah, you that that is you. <laughs> Does he also like with his employees? Yeah, and I was like, oh, God, <laughs> <laughs> sir, that went a place. <laughs> I do that that condescending Amazon's like, thank you, yeah, for yeah, all that you're doing. Well, okay, so 
I, <laughs> I've seen some tweets where people are like, shout out to all the companies who are like making commercials instead of paying has like paying hazard paid all their employees. And I'm like, we, as customers, we all know what we're doing, <laughs> right? Right? Yeah. Yeah, I primed we, something yesterday. So. <laughs> Amen. I'm well, waiting hey, on things it's right It's not now. my fault that it's available to me. Right. It's somebody's <laughs> fault for making it available to me. But the thing is, <laughs> the way people explain it is that if we didn't pay the corporations, they would, my son agrees. Yeah. If we didn't pay corporations. Like, is that a slide whistle? Or is that your son? <laughs> like, if we didn't feed them, then they wouldn't have anything to do. But then it's kind of like, it's just so easy. Yeah. So I'm like, I don't, I'm sorry. I am sorry, but here hey, I am. Hey, it's, it's, it, politicians deal with that. Not me. <laughs> what am I going to do? Yell at a cloud? Like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's just so easy. So, I mean, a part of me, I'm like, look, I, I'm sorry. It's a, uh, find me somebody else who does ethical two day shipping you yeah. know? and I'll move. So I'll what, move. I, what I'm going to do is I'll complain do about the injustice while ordering products from yeah. them. <laughs> Yeah, it's been kind of a bummer right now that uh, they've like halted their two day shipping on a lot of products because of like COVID nineteen. So I'm like, man, I'm yeah. I didn't realize how spoiled I was. There's still dumb stuff you can buy. I bought Lauren like a stuffed bunny <clears throat> for Easter. Really? Yes. Is that essential? You mean you didn't get it out of the claw machine the old fashioned way? <laughs> yeah. You said is that essential? <laughs> is that essential? Really, I I, I don't like. Uh, the 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 classifications of essential and non essential, <laughs> yeah. and I'm like that is relative, right? Yeah, Re- professional relative. wrestling is essential. Yeah, Chinese restaurants those are essential. Yeah, those are essential, Except but they're not. Yeah. For the moment, rest in peace. Oh. I really hope they come back. Huh? They, oh, really? Yeah, there's like a sign on the door. It's like, dear valued customers, <clears throat> until further notice, we're like halting business. Man, yeah. hey, you know they're just making bomb Chinese food at their house though. <sighs> I need to become like a family friend. <laughs> so, have you ever been to TR Oriental? No, uh-uh. I know Dude, where. I mean, I've been, oh. I've been by it. But so that's like PD eats there no less than uh, <laughs> any day that ends in Y. Right. <laughs> yeah. I, that's, a, that's a running thing it's, I've gathered it's, from, it, from, I, from it's the It's upsetting to me now yeah. that I just can't have it for so, so long. I was telling you PD a, a couple of episodes ago. I was like, so they always eat uh, like their family in the afternoons. They'll eat on like a long table together. Mm-hmm. But then PD's like, you know, he prides himself in like, you know, like they know my order. I'll just walk in and sit down and like I'll have a tab and I can come back and pay tomorrow. I'm yeah. like, dude, yeah. don't talk to me unless you get invited to the <laughs> yeah. table, man. Like the day that don't you walk in there me. and I'm with the family, clicking yeah. chopsticks and eating. I mean, I have the Wi Fi password. I feel like <laughs> yeah, I'm yeah, okay. You are family. That's next. That's yeah. next level. But I'm like, I'm working point, my way. I'm learning a little Mandarin. <laughs> <laughs> I'm. Yeah, they trust you too much there. But uh, yeah, when you get when you get to that point, that's when I'm gonna be like, man, you get them uh, the TRs Oriental frequent flyer miles. Yeah. <laughs> when I find out who their teriyaki sauce supplier is, Ooh. that's yeah. Uh, should, man, should, Walmart show teriyaki door. sauce does not compare. Yeah, it just doesn't slap. No. Yeah, it's bad. Yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> I know. That was a restaurant in town. Yeah, I'm, we're spoiled. <laughs> <laughs> It's That's like, where it do they get it from? Because I can't yeah. find a good teriyaki sauce. Yeah, you want to talk to, you always want to talk to the supplier. Um, <laughs> That's all just it cut out the, cut out the just middle cut man. out the middle yeah. man. <laughs> it's like, where do they get the rice? Where do they get their teriyaki? Where do they get their chickens? Forget drug deals. I want Asian <laughs> sauce deals. Hey, man, you get the sauce? Yeah. yeah no, sauce. <laughs> Dude, there's a, there's a restaurant that used to do Korean barbecue, uh, which is like oh, a conglomerate. pork of, Korean barbecue. Yeah. And then there's that uh, popcorn chicken. Yeah, uh, there's this restaurant. Oh, so the Walmart deli. Uh, no, no, it was, this, uh, it was this, this weird is a bar other restaurant. Yeah, <laughs> that you should not. I, I think it was like a bad idea for you to be bringing youth students <laughs> oh, in because oh, one so, day we look, look up. Look, I uh, <laughs> look. I was not. Have we talked about this on the show? I don't think so. I there was this. Bar, what is? You say bar. I hate <laughs> you say bar. It was a bar. A part of it was also Half a restaurant. Half of it was a bar. A, but they okay. also. But Applebee's um, has a bar. Yes. Yes. Um, but it, what was it called again? Dive and Boar. It's called Dive and Boar. Dive Ooh, Bar. Okay, wait a minute. <laughs> Come on, you're not. <laughs> but the boar part, the boar, that's the, the hog. Um, it's one letter away so from being have... bar. Take out the O, it's Dive Bar. <laughs> <laughs> okay, root beer. 
Uh, so we used to go there. We found out that they did like, uh, like, uh, what was it? Like a happy hour? Like a happy <laughs> You're really helping, helping the cause. <laughs> no, 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 no. Listen, listen. This listen not bar had a happy hour. <laughs> they didn't have, what was it though? It was like a discounted. It was like after, it was half price apps. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, all right, yeah. Half yeah. price apps. Sorry. I'll give you hour. that. That's I not the same thing. Like, I know. Like, it was like after eight. <laughs> and, uh, and I found out that they used to do this thing, uh, it was called pulled pork potato skins, which was like, hold on, ooh, let me hold describe up. it too. No, no, that was a, that I was, a, I want these. It is, it's waffle fries, crisp waffle, wa- waffle fries, <laughs> and uh, it's got like, oh, there was cheese, a waffle fries and popcorn scallions. chicken scallions. Yeah, okay, like it's got like some ranch, something, some hot ranch or something, pulled pork, and then it's topped with. Uh, with like shredded cheese and Korean barbecue sauce. And this is this is where exactly? It's Dude, dead. It used to... Ca- no. They're dead. Oh yeah. They, I'm sorry. That's what I should have ended. But they still do it at the new restaurant that they... Like they switched names, I guess, or whatever. LTO. And it came on like a pan this big. Oh. <laughs> and let me tell you something. It was amazing. Mm. We used to go there all the time. Yeah. And then one time the pastor... <laughs> I was thinking about it, the pastor... <laughs> had heard that oh. this was not like it was like not a good restaurant and the one time he was like yeah i'll come with you guys <laughs> him and his wife joined us and yeah. there were so many f words in all the music <laughs> played they had like a like, dj who was like was yeah. like mixing so much filthy music was played and i we i guess we just didn't pay attention because we liked it right <laughs> And that was like a, a like a strike against my ministry. Yeah, uh, was I was like I, I'm taking students to a bar, and <laughs> I st- I think we were being a light in the darkness. <laughs> oh, <laughs> God's mm. not dead. Uh, was it four, seven? I can't remember. Need for what is it? <laughs> Tokyo Drift? I can't remember. <laughs> yeah, uh, Pastor. That's why we're going to the drug den mm. neighborhood <laughs> to be a light. Uh, no, but I remember one time. It was good food, though. It PD. was great food. You always you you don't stress that. You <laughs> always mention the bar part. And I'm like, could you talk about the well, quality of the food first, um, please? Th- there, was, there was one day where we went to like three different restaurants. I think we just like weren't feeling anything, and then we get into that place and we look up, and there's this painting of Johnny Cash flipping us off, and we're like, this is a sign. We just need to leave. Oh <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, so there was that too. <laughs> yeah. but look, I know the exact picture see, you're talking about. See the. <sighs> Yeah, man, <laughs> it was huge. This picture yeah. of Johnny Cat was huge. It was Great a canvas. Painting. It was painted. It was huge. Yeah. Yeah. It's massive. Yeah. I mean, it was like as far as the painting goes, it was a yeah. good. It was like you know, it was good quality. Quality painting. Yeah, but it was like the flung uh, paint, right? Yeah. It was like that uh, thing. Nice. Yeah, it was pretty cool. Oh, and looking. there was this like big uh, picture of a pig with a chains, and I was, yeah. I was like, piggy small. Yeah, the notorious <laughs> pig. <laughs> yeah, dude, I forget about that. I was equal parts a good and terrible youth pastor. <laughs> <laughs> well how was your were you like a crazy youth person um probably not <laughs> i mean i don't have you been in youth ministry you you grew up in youth ministry yeah right? yeah yeah. have you ever served on youth ministry yes never like as the guy yeah so like i was never uh, fully responsible for anything you're yeah, not getting in trouble so. <laughs> that was like so part of my experience i got uh i got yelled at a fall retreat one time you got yelled for, at yeah for what there was a there was a dock at the lake at this camp we were on, and it was clearly broken. It was like the middle of it was sunken into the lake, and I was just kind of jumping but on it. As a youth, you've got to test that. You got to see. Youth trip, like, you've got to. You, okay, you're legally obligated. Will it hold me? Will it hold me? <laughs> I mean, as long as you don't wind up in the sunken place. Right. You're yeah. Fine. I'm dry. We're good. So, did you? But, t- what happened? I got off of it. <laughs> I love I, that the tone shifted. You were like, I was reprimanded. Yeah. yeah. I was. I had to do the reason. I, I minded the rules pretty well. <laughs> yeah. As a youth. Dude, the, the, there's a complete tone shift. When you go from like, uh, I loved being a volunteer. But then all of a sudden you realize that once you become a leader, you're like, man, this is. I have way yeah. much. had more fun. Right. When all the responsibility wasn't on me. And if you had you as a volunteer when you were a leader, you would hate you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I mean, I was not. Uh, yeah, I was. I was. I was. A, I was. I just drank Mountain Dew and I was rowdy the whole time. <laughs> yeah, I did. Uh, I was a small group leader for a group of seventh grade boys. Yeah. Uh, my freshman year of college, and we got to the the place we were doing for our retreat, and I looked at the names on the door. And it was like kid, 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 leader, and then it had my name, and I was like, "Hmm, who's the who's the adult in here?" 
And then I looked around. I was like, frick, I'm the adult in here. But <laughs> <laughs> That's always a bad. And then when kids come, you're like, "All right, li- uh, let's listen to me." Right? Like, what am I doing? <laughs> you're like 18 years old. <laughs> so the thing is, though, I, re- I remember going to camps and uh, like your camp counselor. You're uh-huh. like, "Oh, he's an adult." Right? Yeah. And you're like, "Oh, he's a he's the leader." But then, like, I've been the leader at a camp, and I'm like, "What am I <laughs> doing?" But then I'm like, "Oh, they think I'm the leader." Right? Yeah. And I'm like, the guy now that they thought. It was kind of weird. Having you as a, a camp, uh, when I, as the cabin leader, yeah. one year because it's just like Shama, our goofy friend, is now supposed <laughs> to be like, like the responsible. Stay off your phone, yeah, right. And, and I, I remember on my phone. like we all had our iPods and stuff, and uh, we would just try to hide them. And I remember you like caught me with headphones one day, and then, and then yeah, the yeah, next this day, is, this is so dumb. I put Dude. headphones on, just and I, I plugged. Well, I think I plugged. You didn't the plug it into anything. Into you just had it like in your pillow or something. Yeah, and I was like, I'm like. Listen to my PD. pillow, Shaba. I was like, PD, <laughs> what are you listening to? And I was trying to like, you know, li- and he's like, I'm not listening to anything. And it was just like one of those like, <laughs> dude, come on, man. I got a clipboard. Like, I got a clipboard and a name come badge. On, right? I'm just trying to get through this week. And then I like oh pull the cord, I mean, the cord out of my pillow. I'm like, I was listening to my pillow, man. <laughs> dude, you know, t- here's a funny story. The first camp, uh, Juan Hakalugi that I, I was a counselor <laughs> on. You were, you, dude, it's, there's an old picture. We'll put it up. PD is like a baby. It was you and Ishmael. We were took you a picture of you. One? I oh, was, yeah, you, I remember. Oh, oh was it, you mean, was it the camp that, uh, the, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is real. This I was thinking camp. of a This is a real camp. This is a real camp. An old church yeah, that we yeah. used to go to. And um, this was in North Carolina. So we went, uh, I was put in charge of like the middle school boys. And uh, I didn't know. I was just like, yeah, they're cool. And uh, in a tent. So, we camped and it was like a great time. And I remember, uh, apparently you, your parents always had terrible news rece- like told to them <laughs> after, after any what? trip you were on. Oh yeah. You was just <laughs> rowdy. And, uh, that trip PD did so well that I remember your parents like flanked me at church the next Sunday <laughs> and they were like, what did you do? Or what did you say to PD during this trip? <laughs> Was he that good? What are you hiding? And I was like, nah, he's really just a chill kid. He was like, we had a good time. I guess that was like when I mellowed uh, out. Yeah. A bit. But I guess, I don't know. I, I don't mean, know if I anybody else like, knew how to deal with I you. Still had your parents antics, were like, what did you do? And I'm like, I don't know. I guess I was just more calm about the things I did. Yeah. But then also, I was like, my philosophy of leadership uh, at like a camp or something was like, look, dude. Just like I gotta report to people, so just the more you can make my life easier, <laughs> right? Like this week's gonna go by yeah. easier. Uh, that's it. It's like I don't want to put a bunch of rules on you. I just want us to just let's just hang out. Let's do our. T- I'm doing my time. I'm gonna get like a twenty dollar <laughs> gift card to Applebee's after this, and let's leave. You know what I mean? And, then and maybe, it always worked. I never had like, any problems. I think three camps later, maybe. Um, I I, I told <clears throat> Cecil, the youth pastor, I was like, I am not going. Unless you let me sleep in the tent with my mother <laughs> and not seven guys. Yeah. Oh, I remember that. I remember that. Yeah. And uh, you did. Yeah. <laughs> and I slept great <laughs> because love, nobody was making noise. You know You know what's so funny is to anyone that sounds like a pansy move, <laughs> but if you've ever been, if you've ever slept in a tent with other middle school boys, youth group boys, youth group boys, you will realize that it all, it just smells like booty and onions yes, the first, not the first act. day. And, uh, and yeah, you sleeping in the same tent with your mom wasn't a wimp. That was a power move. Yes. There was space. It was organized. It smelled not like, probably bad. Like incense burning. She probably yeah. had like some diffusion. I like just, a little yeah. fridge. I would just solar listen to podcasts. Yeah. Oils. <laughs> And stuff. Yeah, pod, you know, just yeah, dude, I, it up. Did you know that there were like various times where I would just slip out and go listen to like You Made It Weird <laughs> and eat beef jerky? Wow. <laughs> just chill. And here we were just like fighting, <laughs> <laughs> just killing other kids. There'd be like sometimes like during the camp, I'd be like, I want to go like listen to half an hour of podcast and eat snacks. And that's what you did. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and it's, I remember. It's anarchy, man. I remember also I found out that. Uh, it was really comfortable if you just wore your socks around, <laughs> and they would be disgusting by the end of the day. Like just like just wearing covered with dirt. socks, yeah. just like no yeah. sho- no shoes. Just I socks. just like picked like one pair of socks. I was like, these are my like walking around the camp socks outside. Like, yeah, walking like, around is, the this dirt is comfortable. grass. And then um, I was like, I don't care that they're disgusting. Who am I trying to impress? <laughs> <laughs> See, that's the thing. There's like uh, 
middle school boys, middle school girls, high school boys, and high school girls. <laughs> the middle school boys are just are just the the animals. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Who don't, they don't care about anybody. Yeah. They don't care about how they're perceived. They don't care about what they say. They don't care about farting. <laughs> yeah. And then everybody else is like, I'm trying, I'm trying to impress the girls. And right. The girls yeah. are like, I'm trying to impress the guys. Those high school boys, they're and, trying to take home a, a, a <laughs> chick at the end of the yeah, week. Yeah. They're trying to get married in three yeah. to five right. years. They're trying to become pen pals. Yeah. Then, pen you know. pals. Uh, uh, or now yeah. it's, now it's Snapchat. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Snapchat. Like, shut up. Um, I have a vendetta against that app that I, I was ranting about. Yeah, I was going to say, you were hitting it pretty hard on Twitter last week. <laughs> were, you never, were you never on Snapchat? No, <clears throat> I think I tried it, and I was like, this is so stupid. Yeah. Yeah, I'm glad that the wave is kind of, you know, there was a time when people were like, uh, these streaks or whatever. I'm like, what? You're That's just, what I was railing against on what? Twitter. <laughs> yes. A what? But there are literally kids that will, like, use it as a texting app. Like they will, they will communicate and to each other. That, the lack of because the if, lack of needing permanence it, it doesn't is make very sense. shocking I, to me. I yes. want to look at what I've said. Hey, that's right. the whole point of saying <laughs> things. When, when somebody yeah. responds, it's like, wait a minute, what did I, what did I say? What did, yes. say? But, <laughs> what did I say? But then, like another thing was like, I, I think uh, I said something up yesterday. I was like, uh, every time a. Uh, <laughs> Every okay, time, a, every time me. a church this staff, hurt me. <laughs> sorry. <dude. laughs> every time a church staff member makes a TikTok, an uh, angel loses its wings. <laughs> wait a second, that hurt. Do we have a talker? We have I don't, a, you I don't make them. Okay, well, okay, you're. But I would say, I would say, there are people who I think are genuinely funny. Yes. Stay on TikTok. Okay. You deserve to be well, on TikTok. You. Jonathan Schwarter <laughs> deserves to be on TikTok. <laughs> this is a rail against anybody who just hears like the youth are on TikToks. I'm gonna be on TikTok. Get off TikTok. <laughs> Dude, what's You're this? killing angels. This, like, I, I keep hearing something about a flim flam. I, what a flim flam? <laughs> what? Is that, I thought that was like a, a trend on TikTok. Something flim to do with flam? flim flam. Is that, is that what Am happens I just old? in your sinuses? What is, I, I, mean, I feel like I'm 50. <laughs> I'm like, what are the kids doing with their flim flams? One of the, one of the kids in our, in our youth group got a new car. And I texted him the other day and I was like, I heard you got some new wheels. And the same thing. I was like, how old yeah. am I? What, what am I, a 50-year-old man? Let's back up to the point where PD thought flip flip. <laughs> I you saw. Thought, I, you I was thought, on Twitter. What and I, I swear I saw the word flim flam like three different times. I was like, "What is this trend?" Can you verify this? Could you look? Could you look up flim flam? What is flim flam? <laughs> oh my gosh! It's first result. <laughs> Am I right? I don't know. Because I felt like a 60-year-old saying, what are the kids doing with what their is, flim flams? What is flim flam? <laughs> there's, oh, a, there's an account called Mrs. Flim Flam with 82,000 oh, followers. I got the tiniest piece of tissue. You, what did you... <laughs> I was like, is this some kind of dance challenge? <laughs> <laughs> they look like Lego people. Uh, what are you... Is, it, is that the... Is Ms. it flim flam? flam? Google. Could you Google Flim Flam TikTok? I'm in a coma pee. You sound so. You're going to listen back to this and realize how ridiculous you sound. Trying to like piece together an internet thing that probably does not exist. I made up. Oh my gosh. The dictionary says nonsensical or insincere talk. So I just made this up. <laughs> you made up a word about making up words. <laughs> the example is I suppose I <clears throat> I suppose <laughs> nothing, that you suspect me of nothing for TikTok. Pseudo intellectual <laughs> flim flam. So all you got was the definition of the That's word. That's all I got, man. So I completely, in my mono fever dreams, <laughs> made up a TikTok trend. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I got something. This is a sound. I haven't vetted it's this. It's just one sound. It may though, not right? be appropriate. <laughs> I feel like 
be like <laughs> I think that's all that's it that's, <laughs> that's it I, I see think, myself ticking and talking to that <laughs> <laughs> flimming and flamming and ticking and talking you know <laughs> I think I think that's 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 how once you're not like a teen anymore <laughs> trying to make this is exactly how trying to make sense of teens is. You're like dab what da- what? <laughs> dab what? The hardest I've laughed in a while. <laughs> I'm like oh, <laughs> Oh my! You, you, your brain created a trend that you thought was a trend that I mentioned a on a podcast because I was so confident about it. And can we call this episode the Flim Flam <laughs> Challenge? The one with Flim Flam. <laughs> <laughs> oh, All you man. TikTokers out there, <laughs> now we gotta create the Flim, <laughs> the Flim Flam Challenge. I'm like crying and sweating, man. This is ridiculous. Oh my god. Uh, oh, uh, I don't even. That's uh, so stupid. <laughs> <laughs> well, JG, uh, man, it's, it's po- called church stories. <laughs> that you work for a church. I do. Do you have any church stories you want to say, man? Mm. You don't have any church stories. <laughs> I, I need a water or something after what? that. <laughs> <laughs> we take a half time. Do <laughs> <laughs> so I get some water? They yeah, got they got I'll glasses be, up there. I'll be right back. We'll set up. Uh, JG's gonna set yeah. up the uh, the uh, got glasses up there up top, and then. Uh, Got cold water in the fridge. <coughs> nice. Sophie can help you out. My sister in law Sophie. My sister in law Sophie's here helping us. Um But yeah, man, we're we're gonna we're gonna get in some church stories right now. Let's do it. Let's wait for P D to come back. Flim flam. <laughs> I that is just you can bring that glass in here, Padaba. Hey, PD, you, use the fridge. Uh, g- just open the fridge. There's some water in there. Yeah. I don't know what we're going to do with this portion. <laughs> uh, PD's getting hydrated. Uh, speaking of hydration, the uh, the sponsor of the show is water. Uh, <laughs> you can access water, water at any tap or uh, flowing stream. Yeah. Um, guys, once again, that's water. Uh, <laughs> promo code free twenty twenty. Uh, <laughs> that's promo code free twenty twenty. Just yeah. input that. We're gonna link that in the description below, <laughs> and uh, you can check that out, guys. Once again, the sponsor of the show. Check it out. Water. Yeah. H two O. Also known as H two O. Get some water today. <laughs> get out. Get out of here. <laughs> This lamest this ad. This show is never going to get ads. What? My the advertisers favorite. is going to read that. Listen to that. They're going to be like, what? Did they? What? Dude, I went back and listened to. We did an episode with Ari. And um, I, for some reason, I was like, this episode is brought to you by Bud Light. <laughs> I remember and, that. And I was like, what are you saying? <laughs> I was like, I just want to derail our brand <laughs> so bad. <laughs> This episode's brought to you by vaping. That, that was the first episode of y'all's show that I listened to. <laughs> really? I used to drive a delivery truck part time. Yeah. And so I would just throw a podcast and on. And you turned it off. You and threw your phone out the window. <laughs> I was like, this seems uncharacteristic of the last 45 minutes. Yeah. But <laughs> we only get like the worst sponsors of this show. Yeah. Hey, a check is a check is a check is yeah, a there check. There you go, right? This is brought to you by Mono. Uh, uh, <laughs> we uh, we actually just uh, we signed a deal with the co- uh, we talk. we signed a deal with the company, and the company yeah. does Instagram ads. Our and corporate overlords. They get they get they get straight just railed in, well, the, insta- in hey. the Instagram. The comments, yeah. people are like, what are y'all doing? I hope they've, taking no- I hope they've been taking <laughs> note of all the people who have been tagging me. Yeah. Be like, I really <laughs> just saw Paul in this. <laughs> or, bro, let's go. <laughs> or like, I guess people are just like happy for me yeah. that I'm on something. Yeah. We'll, we'll, I, we'll tell you, we'll tell you the name of it. But yeah, we, we, we have, we've partnered up with this company. Hey, and, uh, they're our corporate overlords. We yeah. should be proud of them. Yippee, baby. <laughs> So we do this. Are you guys right, so we, we're, we're on a streaming service called Yippee TV. Yeah, I actually. Oh, that was real. I dude, thought I, you were just honestly. I can't. I can't. I can't. 
uh, so I'm gonna have to bleep all this out. Really? Because I yeah, I did this? sign. Yeah, I did. You I signed something. We're not allowed to talk about you, people you featuring the, us on their thing. You broke the Veggie Tales news on Steeple People. Yeah. Okay. Well, you know what? Okay. <laughs> sure. Wait. <laughs> we're on. Okay. So I'm we say. signed something. We're not allowed to. Are we not allowed to talk about the business deal? I or think we not we're not allowed. allowed. No, we're, we are allowed to talk about it. But what I wanted to say was... Well, y'all y'all stop, ads. stop listening. It's just <laughs> us stop, talking. Just yeah. <laughs> Fast forward just like 30 dudes. seconds. Uh, uh, <laughs> they run ads and their ads don't do well. <laughs> it's the grill. <laughs> but people will tag us. So oh, when we, because we're in the ad. Yeah. So we'll see it. And we'll be like, Have you been what are y'all tagged doing? Too? Yeah, I get tagged okay. too. But then I'm like... It's good to be. Oh, it's, the yeah. house is on, everything's on fire. I remember Holy somebody God. was like, "I re- like like at Paulia, how do you, how do you feel about being in uh, an ad for a homeschool YouTube?" And I said, "Yippee is a wonderful company, and I am very proud to be partnered with them." Yeah, and uh, <laughs> look, look. We secured the bag, and I hope. Yes. All and I'm saying is, I hope whoever's running their social media. Uh, Continues uh, will learn to do note of better. The fact that we're also takes note of the fact that we're getting tagged. Yes, which means people are noticing yes. that our faces are in their thing, <laughs> and that they should give us more money. Uh, <laughs> but all I'm saying was, I just said that to say that their Instagram ads don't do too well, yeah. and the only reason why we see well, them is because we'll get tagged in them because our friends will see them. They don't, and then we're like, oh. They, this who, is good who, and bad. It's like who are they not doing well for? They're not doing well for people who don't have children. Um, I think like if, if you're like, you know, someone like you yeah, who has a kid yeah, and you don't want them watching Elsa doing a drive by on YouTube somehow, yeah, yeah you might awesome want game. this service. Yeah. So that's my ad. So it's, <laughs> <laughs> hey, you, you want to protect you your kids from Spider-Man seeing Elsa, and Elsa mugging Spider-Man? People. Yeah. <laughs> Yippee. <laughs> oh, I'm so conflicted on whether we should leave that internet. <laughs> uh, is this going to come back to bite us? I, I mean, that's why we have a lawyer. <laughs> <laughs> the lawyer's going to be either be like, delete everything off the internet right now. <laughs> Shave your heads. Change your names. Move to China right now. Right now. I mean, hey, we're talking about your company. This Probably is free not right PR. now. I mean, yeah. you don't want to go to China right now. You know what? Oh, sorry. You know, maybe not. <laughs> Maybe lay low and eventually. Right. Is this how Anthony Jeselnik place. feels when he trashes Comedy Central on his Comedy maybe. Central podcast? <laughs> yeah, maybe. <laughs> we secured the bag. <laughs> the I, ba- we secured the bag. Hey, hey, I'm not trashing the company. I am happy to be an employee. I'm not an employee. <laughs> they just licensed like a few things. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Hey, we, we did the thing. Um, hey, we uh, PD had to get water, and we did an ad. And Welcome we back. This about, is Church Stories. Yeah. I'm JG. <laughs> 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 we did an ad for water, and then we did an ad for our parent company. Yeah. Uh, so <laughs> what are we calling them? Slash. Uh, <laughs> what is it? Uh, overlords. The corporate overlords. overlords. Yeah. Hey, look. <laughs> it is what it is. Okay. Yeah. Y'all know what we do. Y'all know what we do. Hey, listen, but Church <laughs> Stories Podcast is under nobody, baby. All right? Yeah. <laughs> Church Stories Podcast is is us and JG right now. This is We're in charge of it. We're in charge of the whole brand, right? There, Just there, us. There is talking. no money to keep us <laughs> censored. <laughs> Seriously, we are in the red. This podcast makes <laughs> no money at all. We speak, we, we speak, we speak freely because we there's sp- no reason for we, us no, not we, to. We speak freely. <laughs> yeah. There's nobody to be like, guys, grammar on the last episode, just a little, just a little off. I don't know. I'm going to suggest uh, English, <laughs> an English teacher. But no. All right. I feel like Pete Holmes. Are we letting you talk? Are we- <laughs> Sorry. Hey, listen. Bro, I'm here for it. Yeah. I'm here for this. JG, welcome. Welcome back. <laughs> I feel like you know, like whenever you go to a, we a, you a comedian's podcast, like let your guests talk, <laughs> yeah. what, guys. Guys, I feel like the uh, this is for the record. Anybody wants to comment that this is the time we're letting JJ talk. I feel like the producer <laughs> yeah. from uh, from Joe Exotic show, <laughs> yeah. just like watching it all happen. <laughs> You're gonna be in a you're gonna be in a church stories documentary later. Yes. People are gonna see this and be like, "How was?" Be like, "I, dude, I was there." Put my cowboy. Hat. I was on an episode. Uh, <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> but um, did Carol so, do it, JJ? Oh, absolutely, yeah. <laughs> absolutely. I passed a That's, sign the other day uh, in Greer. Yeah. That said, "Honk if you think Carol Baskin killed her husband." <laughs> <laughs> if I see a middle aged woman on a bike now, it's go, Carol. <laughs> <laughs> hey, for the record, hey, I just want to say, PD, do you remember I used to have a bit about Carol? Yeah, I used to have a bit about Carol. Carol, Carol, where I would just yell <laughs> Carol, yeah, over and over, 
and that bit, <laughs> rest in peace, is dead now. Yeah. Because somebody else ye- yelling Carol is more famous <laughs> than me. And uh, but I, that, I was thinking about that the other day, and I was like, I've, I was because I was making a little video. I shaved, and I had a little, little Carol like a handlebar, a little <laughs> a little Joe Exotic uh, handlebar mustache. And, uh, and I yelled, Carol! And I was like, wait a second, this is familiar. I've done this before. <laughs> and I remembered my bit. <laughs> and then I remembered my bit. Um, but no, dude, you, you you work for a church. And like, just tell us about yourself, man. Like, I don't know. You're on the show. You're, yeah. You're here. I'm glad to be here. We're doing it. Yeah, we're doing it. I wasn't it. sure if I was at the right house when I pulled up. Yeah. I saw the Prius in the driveway, and I was like, like <laughs> I, think that, I think this is where yeah, I'm supposed to be. You've definitely heard that mention of the podcast at some yeah, point, right? Yeah. Uh, you've seen the Prius pull up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At the, um, the Jingle Bell. The the Prius, it, this thing crosses the street. Yeah. Uh, it's the most, it, the, a Prius is really the humblest car. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it really is. It just means, hey man, I, hey, I, I, I'm i here. That's all it means. Yeah. I pull up, people are like, <laughs> here I go. And we, we could not have cast a better corny youth pastor. Dude, yeah. <laughs> no offense, because you are in ministry, but uh, <laughs> you embodied the part. Really it, was a, well. it was a real method acting yeah. experience. Yeah. I've really spent good. 24 years or so just link studying. That video at the end of are, the we lit to, yeah, are we great. lit? Are we lit? It was it. so good. Oh, that was so funny, man. Gosh. I think that's the thing. We're always like really trying to like, you know, cast and incorporate people in our projects. And that's scary because we're mm-hmm. like, you know, part of it, like, you don't know how people are going to be. Yeah. But then, yeah. Uh, you know, uh, we've lucked out and we've yeah. like, occasionally we'll get the perfect person. Right. Like, we did. We like so dipped good. into the, this, like we found like a pocket <clears throat> of uh, really talented Nagoo people. Nagoo. Too, Nagoo. Nagoo. That's right. <laughs> But no, 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 dude. Tell us, do you have any church stories, man? Like, oh, you know gosh. the show. You've, yeah, you're a fan. Yeah, yeah, You've been yeah. listening. Um, all right. So I've never. There are like eight people alive that know this story. Um, Ooh. <laughs> are the others dead? <laughs> 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 No, I just never got it. Never got told. Oh, oh, okay, guys, uh, <laughs> I don't have a dead man switch. If you're listening to this, that means that PD and I are no more. <laughs> Only and, eight uh, people can ever know my, about this story. Nine, <laughs> If you're listening, if you've heard up to this point, get your affairs check, in check order. Because <laughs> yeah. JG is after you. Oh my gosh. Yes. So eight people know about so, this. So yeah, I'm I mean, it's, yeah, we just, we didn't tell it much, but I was in like fifth grade. Okay. And so me and one of my best friends, um, we had like the Walmart donuts for Sunday school yeah. snack. Oh, is the powdered ones or the, well, like the glazed ones okay. from the bakery. Yeah. And and we we realized that the adults downstairs had Krispy Kreme donuts. Okay. <laughs> and there's about a 15 or 20 minute period in between when Sunday school ends and when church starts. That y'all went full Mission Impossible. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> and so we would like run downstairs <clears throat> and we'd grab a donut and there was like a like an empty space behind the staircase. Uh-huh. And so we would go like sit in there. People could see us. They knew what we were doing. <laughs> but we thought like, ah, oh, we're hiding. Wait, no what, one can see us. What, 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 what did y'all think y'all were hiding? Like what was hiding? I don't know. It just felt good. It's like it's as close as you can get to a heist as a Christian kid. Right. Yeah. Like, I'm yeah. never going to rob a bank. This but was, I can this was rob Ocean's donuts. Legit, though. Did I did stuff did like that at church all the time. All the time. <laughs> I, you know how many <laughs> cookies I ate for yeah, free? Yeah. yeah. All I would just grab. Literally every service. Are we confessing this I stuff would, right now? Yeah. Oh, I'd always see you. We'd be in like youth ministry, and I'd see you with like a handful of like goldfish and a cup of apple juice, and I'm like, dude, yeah, dude my, I would go down you to the that? kitchen on, downstairs, some... uh, and I would grab Cheetos usually or Doritos, and yes. then I found um, that they would give like cookies out. There was this big box of cookies that they would give to kids, I think, and then I, I found where those are, and I just you know <laughs> ate cookies every Wednesday. Yeah. During church. God bless. That kept me so awake. Y'all, <laughs> so y'all, y'all were eating the... First of all, let me, let me... When you said y'all were hiding... Yeah. That's all... When you're a child, you don't know how to hide. Right. But whatever you do, you think... <laughs> I remember I used to play hide and seek with my brother, and he finally had to explain to me. He's like, if you can see me, <laughs> that means I can see you. And I was like, probably like 10 at the time, and I was like, oh... Yeah. <laughs> That's what that you can't hide behind a skinny tree and be like. <laughs> that's like hiding my eyes. That's what I thought. I thought hide was, was like I hid my eyes. <laughs> so y'all were like hiding. Y'all were stealing the the good donuts. Right. Yeah. And um, this one particular Sunday, we realized we had like two minutes left before church started. We were like, we can get one more. <laughs> 
And so we just bolt down this long hallway. And uh, one of the pastors at the time was, you know, pretty big guy. And he like stuck his hand out. Yeah. My buddy, I mean, because I'm, you know, well, if you're if you're listening to this, you're not seeing this. I'm, yeah. I'm a pretty, you're watching pretty big it. bone fellow. <laughs> and um, anyway, so my buddy was running faster than me. And he just got like truck stick by this this pastor. It wasn't what? on purpose, but he just like <laughs> oh, tr- truck stick is a Madden reference where you oh. like you hit this uh, you hit the analog thing, and then you just like ram into a d- defender and knock him oh, over. Oh, yeah. So that's uh, it's like is a, that stiff arming? Is that is that what that's called? No, it's like when you lower your head as a running back. Oh, oh right. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So this this pastor didn't lower his head. Don't, <laughs> I mean, don't like it wasn't targeted. How don't much get, did don't this get pastor that. care about donuts? He was like, ah. well, so, <laughs> oh wait, uh, one note about that. For the longest time, when I was like six, I thought it was called the truth stick <laughs> instead of the truck stick. Do you have the ball? <laughs> I was like, you hit him with the None truth. None of this QB sneak stuff. <laughs> <laughs> with the truth stick. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Just, oh, man. And then I said that to one of my friends, and he just laughed at me for like an hour. <laughs> <laughs> so, so the pastor. So pastor anyway, hits you, <laughs> anyway, right? It's you, your He's, friend with the truck, with the truth, with the truth, st- <laughs> with the truth stick. <laughs> my buddy, my buddy stopped dead in his tracks, and um, when he was like, "Hey, no, y- y'all can't do this anymore. Go upstairs." We found out after the fact that there were other kids our age who were taking like a couple dozen donuts at a time, <laughs> oh. and like they ruined it for everybody. multiple two liters, yeah, oh my and going gosh. to like a storage closet. Really. And we were like, we were the fall guys <laughs> because they uh, thought it was us. Oh, so they, oh dude, you know and it happened? wasn't. It's like I heard that my uh, rats will send the weaker rats to go eat the poison. <laughs> that's probably and, what it was. Uh, yeah. That's, uh, that's, we're going to let these guys <laughs> mess it up for us. <laughs> See, here's the thing. Uh, let me say, uh, not condoning stealing, <laughs> but, uh, nonetheless stealing in the Lord's house. Yeah. But if you are, you just, you just got to know that you can't. You can't I was, be taking two right, liters. Yeah. I was so open take about a swig. it when I did it, though. <laughs> okay, you I can would... take a swig. You can't take the whole two You know what I mean? I wasn't hiding anything when I would do it. Nobody ever said anything to me. <laughs> I would just yeah. walk around with the stuff. Yeah, church has got good food, though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. You're right. Food, Dude, though. me and um, Ishmael always had this fantasy where after service... We would like I my parents would never agree to this, but I was like, Can y'all just leave us here and we try to hide and survive for a week? Yeah. <laughs> I wanted to do that so bad. I was like, I there's water here, there's, there's a food, there's you know, bathrooms, there yeah. are like bean bags, we can sleep here. That there are video games. That is a very uh those are very kid thoughts. <laughs> like you say that. As a as a child you're always assessing, you're like <laughs> Wait a second. Yeah. <laughs> like we had a uh, we had a uh, uh, some friends come over and visit us a couple weeks ago, and they have three little kids, three little three little mixed kids, and their oldest, his name is Philip. He's probably like uh, maybe like seven or eight. He uh, he comes to me and my no, he tells my wife. My wife told me this later. Yeah, he, he tells my wife like he's already been at our house for a couple of hours. He goes up to my wife. He goes, "When I get my license, I'm gonna come over here and stay for two weeks." <laughs> <laughs> it was just one of those things where like uh thanks right. <laughs> but it was one of those things that he already played when i get my license and he's gotta be 16 at that point he's and like he's when i just get gonna... my license listen i'm coming here <laughs> like it's like i don't even he's not even asking for permission he's like i'm staying yeah, for two I'm, weeks but, <laughs> see, put me in the books my, put my me thing down. was like <laughs> i want to like i was like i want to survive and hide like it's a mission <laughs> Yeah, yeah, and like yeah. I know, I, I was like, they're gonna be meetings and stuff, and we gotta like lay low during the meetings. <laughs> <laughs> like, I thought it'd be such an adventure. Hey, to... yeah, it'd be a cool video game if we had. I, I, this week, this is probably the second time I've thought. I'm like, we really need a friend who knows animation. So uh, if we had a friend, we'd create like survive the church. Yeah, yeah. rated oh, E dude. for evangelistic. That's another thing. Like me and Thomas, <laughs> that was another fantasy. Of uh, we had this, we had this idea of making. Uh, Basically, like Call of Duty, but just in our church. Like, <laughs> take the youth no, no. room and like have those be the maps. Like... Call of Duty church. Yeah. Oh my god. Like main sanctuary. 
uh, youth room, like the back of the church. Like, all like the different maps <laughs> back of, of the, the game. church. Yeah, the yeah. woods. And Choose the, your the pastor oh, under the stage. Can I tell a church story? Yeah, that I don't think I've told on this. Yeah, uh, why are you asking? Yeah, why am I asking? I'm a host of the show. <laughs> um, me and Tony Palacino. I love how you said his first and last name. It's completely <laughs> is that, is that a local no pizza animated. place? Uh, <laughs> yeah, Tony Palacino is a great pizza. <laughs> yeah. Actually, great Palacino. pizza. Is it really? Do, they make, no, no, no. They the, don't make pizza. No, but it's like, a family. It's they a, it's make a family it at their house. Like they do make pizza at their house. Uh, has he been on the show? No, no, he is not. No. He he grips and uh, yeah. he works on a bunch he's of not, all the videos he, we do. He's a spotlight of averse person. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. He, he doesn't have our camera. disease, as I say. The disease. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> really are, man. Is that yes. funny right now? Do you have a disease still? I, I do. I, mean, <laughs> I, I have multiple diseases. <laughs> I have the performer disease and yeah. the mono The disease. mono. <laughs> <laughs> and let's hope not. I don't want to be. I don't have a three-peat with right. corona. But, uh, hey. Yeah, so as I was saying. Corona's like, get him while he's down. <laughs> so, you know, the, 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 the church that we used to go to, there was this big, like, the expanse in the back <clears> of woods. And stuff. Excuse me, man. That, Sorry. Um, I don't. Did they own it? The the woods behind yeah, there. The yeah, church I think own. they did. Okay, so we were walking up, and then there was like a path that we just kept walking, and then we get to where there's like this house, and then we're just standing around, and a guy exits the house with a shotgun. Huh. Pumps it. What? And then we take off. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> Fair <laughs> Have you not heard this ever? No. Did y'all tell anyone? No. <laughs> huh? Huh? Yes. So behind the church? Yeah. We, uh, you behind know, like, the church? Behind the church? In the woods? Yes. So like maybe like to the right where there's just like there's a path that we're there, walking along it. Is there a car road? Uh, I think. <laughs> I no, no no there wasn't. It was just like dirt I think. Okay. Um, so y'all were just walking in the woods. Yes. And then we get to this, you know, it's like a rundown. It's not the nicest house. And then we're standing around and, uh, huh? Yeah. We're not like, oh, we're not like in the guy's yard or anything. We're just like in the area. And then he walks out with a shotgun and, uh, we're like, oh, it is a uh, check please. And like, <laughs> uh, just took off why running. Why did y'all run? What were we going to do? I mean, the man I pumped mean, a shotgun. Uh, there's a shotgun. What well, the- his shotgun is, is going to get you. <laughs> he lets it loose. Yeah, I didn't want to stand around and take it. I would rather be running. Yeah, it, I would yeah. rather make an attempt to get away that's than a, just be like, you, "All right." Uh, <laughs> that's a, you, you made a you made a video game move in real life. <laughs> Dude, so we just we don't know where we're going either. We take off into like the middle of this woods, and then we're running full speed. And then I hear Anthony go barbed wire, and I look oh. down. And I'm running full speed, and I just have to make the decision to jump over the barbed wire. And luckily, I didn't get cut by it. Gosh, man. And then we uh, made our way back to church and uh, in time for service. Y'all didn't tell anybody? No. <laughs> man, that would have been, been a sad news story. Yeah. I guess <laughs> I didn't realize how intense that story was. Yeah. I mean, There's a dude. lot to that. Okay. <laughs> So he cocked the shotgun. Yep. That, 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 I have a vivid memory of this like white trash looking dude. Nobody does that. <laughs> Ooh, watch Usually, your language. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> when people do that, th- what follows next is death. <laughs> like, Typically. Like, it's never uh, like, how y'all doing? <laughs> it's not like, Merry Christmas. No. Just that check is, and make sure she still works. How y'all been? And, and I love that you're, I, I, I don't know. My, my thought, I, I'm, I sound very white already. I feel like I would just get like, excuse me, sir. Like, I mean, no problem. Like, I feel like I would just get whiter and be like, sir, do we have an issue? But y'all, why did you decide to just like, r- like, we're going to chance it. We're fourth grade. As in like, <laughs> as in like, kids. we can outrun. Like, We've never been around somebody this. with a gun. So Man. it was just like, we had no idea what to do. So we just ran. Gosh. I feel like I'm going to ask Tony about this and he's going to be like, oh my gosh, I forgot about that. <laughs> It sounds, I mean, it's pretty bad. <laughs> it sounds pretty bad. And like the, the likelihood that we, either one of us could have been cut by barbed wire that we didn't know was there. And then just for him to go, barbed wire! And for me to <laughs> look down and, sit and jump over it. <laughs> but you know what? I uh, The thing about just ministry in general, like being, a, being in youth or kids ministry, let me say youth ministry, 
if you don't almost die, you, you didn't really live. You know what I mean? Like, seriously. You're if right. you didn't, I, I remember one time we like outran dogs. We were hiking back here. It snowed and we would always hike around my neighborhood oh when my it gosh. snowed. And we were like walking. We we're like, oh, the lake, because we would live close to a lake. We're like, oh, a lake. And we're like walking down this person's driveway and dogs started. And like, we were like, <laughs> It's like six or seven of us and some of them like slipping and falling <laughs> and we all like ran and then afterwards i remember thinking like hmm. and one kid got eaten hmm. you know. <laughs> it's just one of those things where you think like uh, that could have went worse <laughs> but it didn't <laughs> and uh i don't know why we didn't freak out it's just one of those things like oh, my dogs get you well know what I mean? it happens i you don't know? know man what are you gonna do yeah that's uh, terrible dude so what uh what is your i don't know man what is the what is your goal in, in ministry do you like enjoy working for a church do you still want to do it like in the future i do yeah 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 um yeah so there was a time that i was thinking about maybe transitioning more towards like media stuff yeah. i really i really do love um just video and graphics and creative media and stuff yeah um but since that's that's all i've been doing for the past six mm. weeks because of <laughs> the well, quarantine yeah yeah i'm kind of like no no i really like hanging out with students like that's <laughs> that's that's my vibe well i mean so there's like i mean there's a uh uh, creating for a church is different. You know yes, what I mean? that's, right. So that's fair. What you're doing though is a, uh, I mean, not that you're getting a, a a quick, like a very fast form of of uh, uh, basically it's like the expedited course of just doing it. Right. And um, I will say a ton of like really great directors and creators that I'm a big fan of all started off at churches. Heck, I started off at <laughs> church. So yeah. yeah, it's kind of crazy. Well, there you go. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Cause it's just one of those things where you always you're always creating. Yeah, you're you're around a team of people who have the means to create. Right, and there's a need. So well, you know, it's just like this intense version of creating. Yeah, and I think maybe part of it is like the, I don't want to say lack of creativity, yeah. but like when we're doing services, yeah, like we try to mirror what we do on a Sunday morning. Uh huh. Um, whereas like. If it's a if it's a camp or something and we're spoofing Stranger Things, yeah, like that's different. I I really enjoy that yeah. still. But hey, man, Manger Things. Manger. That's a oh, meme I saw. Oh my goodness, dude! Uh, I just <laughs> we called ours weirder objects. <laughs> really? Do y'all use the same font though? Yeah, I like that. <laughs> yeah, there, there's um, uh, I, there, I. Well, how do I say this? How do I say this? I. I, I I I sometimes I I've been a big fan of some church creativity, but then I've also really really loathed some church creativity as well. Yeah. Oh yeah. Like uh, the ones that we've been to, like I serve with the iPhone. Font. Yeah. How do I I serve? Mm. I serve by I give, I love, I go, <laughs> and you're like, and then like here's a T-shirt for free, and you're like I I'm gonna burn this. Yeah. With fire. But um, dude, oh, dude, oh my gosh! I just thought about this. I was trying to write a post, but I couldn't. I went to a camp. I went to a camp. <laughs> I, I worked at this camp. It was a. Uh, I'm gonna say the denomination. Oh, How about that? Ooh. I'm gonna say it. It was a Church of God camp. Oh. It was in Malden. Um, Cog a, baby. A Cog baby. Uh, we went to a Church J-O of God of, of prophecy. So I, I kind of, uh, I, okay. I cheated. I, I, I went to the enemy's camp, yeah. and uh, and honestly, Literally, the, I did. The camp. Their camps were amazing, like legit. It was the best camp I've ever been to. But here, the theme of the camp was called was viral. It was called viral. Yeah, and they had like the toxic like logo or whatever. The, oh the, gosh! And the and I cannot tell you how many times I heard make your faith go viral and that really spawned mm, things that aged like milk day. yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, dude dude it was yeah. and they had and they had like like oil like oil drums on stage with like the spray painted logo you know and um yes oh, yeah. it just it's just one of those things yeah. that <laughs> i love yeah, a set design like, that really goes hard though <laughs> like at least record, they went it for really it cool. it was really cool <laughs> yeah. it um, was really cool but it was one of those things i was thinking about that later and i was like uh, you know because we at the time Nobody really has an idea of what viral is, but all the pastors are like, man, there, there's like, you know, make your faith spread like a disease. But now a disease is actually spreading. It's kind of like, huh? Um, uh, wait, 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 wait. Just make your uh, yeah. faith just <laughs> spread um, organically, hey, like seeds, maybe. What if, like we... the Bible said? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Um, I, I finished my water, 
Water. Cool. Water. Uh, <laughs> another ad for water. Water. Today's show brought to you by Dr. Water. Phil Hell says yeah. 370,000 people die in it every year. <laughs> water. <laughs> that's a uh, water. That's a, Fox uh, News. Like Coke without the sugar guy plug for water. And that is not true. No, 370,000 no. people don't die in swimming pools. What do you... Okay. Let, we, <laughs> he said that. He did? On the news. Yeah. Like it was real. Well, yeah. So that's when the... There's been a big call to like, you know, we got to we got to stop trusting TV doctors. Yes. Oprah. What did you do? I can't, Dr. I can't wait for the, the biopic about Dr. Phil. Is Oprah responsible like, for Dr. Oz, <laughs> like, too? I mean, I, I'm, I wouldn't doubt it. I think so. I, you know, I so there is a uh, Francis Chan who I'm a, a, a fan of. I can't really say I'm a fan of. I, you know, I enjoy some of his talks and some of his books. <laughs> He one time said something. He was like, "When, um, he was like, when is ever the when has the right thing ever been popular?" And uh, I, th- I I think about that a lot. So, so usually like you know when something's really popular, um, and then you're like, "Oh, well, faith Christianity is popular." But then, like, is it really like people yeah, dying? Right. So it's like Dr. when it comes to like yeah. Doctor Phil like, and like all those doctors. Yeah, it's like it. It, when anytime something's like really popular, like what's the, what is the catch? Well, the catch what is, is the catch? That it's just it's for ratings. It's like the shows yeah. are ridiculous, and it's he's not a real doctor. No, and, no, and <laughs> and, and so um, okay, being having worked in the industry, air quotes the industry, uh, people think that there's like this un this it, like other oh, issue. Like, what is the goal? And I worked with VeggieTales, and people were like, oh, I'm reading article, people were like, VeggieTales is watering down the truth. But then I'm like, dude, in the thick of it, you're just trying to figure out words that rhyme with cat for a song. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Like, you're like, yeah. what's the funniest thing to say here? Let's not say that, let's say this. Like, there's no agenda. Same thing with, like, in the news, though. They're really like, what sells? Yeah. Like, what's going to hook people the uh, quickest and keep them the longest? So, I don't know, though. It, I mean, it's, it's not right. But I, I don't know. How are you staying? Because we are still in quarantine. Oh, yeah. I uh, guess we'll, we'll... I love how we, we're in quarantine. Yeah. I'm in quarantine. <laughs> we Y'all done, broke we it to Germany. We corona talk. It's more like... No, uh, it's just been stuff yeah, talk. it's been stuff talk. What? <laughs> J, uh, let me ask you this, uh, JG. What? Yep. When did you realize that the uh, the the COVID-19 was as serious as it is right now? Um. Let's see. It was... It was a little, last week. Of, it's been a long time, though. Yeah, it was like the last week of March, I think. Yeah. Uh, one of my roommates. I used to live in a house with four guys, and one Sorry, of my dude. <laughs> <laughs> long story short, the house got sold, and oh, me and really? one of the guys just moved into an apartment okay. this weekend. Yeah, that's fun. But um, one of my roommates came home. He works at BB&T, and he was like, "Hey, they sent everybody home because somebody upstairs came in contact with someone who was a confirmed huh? case," and I was like. Oh, so like, how does how does that affect me? Because we live in in the same house and stuff. So like, if it's on you, do I have it? I mean, yeah. Shoot, this and is so after I, he like dapped you up. He's like, yeah, they sent us home early, dude. I'm, You're like, D- what? I've <laughs> never been more aware of people. Yeah, and right. How close they get to me. Yeah, yeah. Well, we've got a we've got a senior adult minister, sweet sweet lady, who's in her like mid eighties, that's at our office every day. Huh? And. So I, I called. My, She's gonna live forever. My immediate boss, <laughs> and I was like, "Hey, like, should I?" He was like, "Yeah, don't, don't come in, because if she gets it, like, like that's on you." And I was like, yeah. "I don't want that to be on me." So, so you just haven't been in. in? Well, so I did like the like the seven day thing. Yeah. Oh, because you were in con. Yeah, yeah, yeah dude. Right. That's that's the mental gymnastics. So I really, man. I really I didn't can't. leave home for seven days, and that really? was that was awful. You know how like Sheesh. scared I was when I got mono, and I was like, I. What if, like, for the length of this pandemic, I'm my immune system is compromised? Oh. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I mean man, dude. I don't luckily, know, man. I, I bounced back I, I from that asthma. L. I have but. asthma, and I mean, I know that I'm at risk because it's a lung disease. But yeah. I mean, I haven't worn a mask and I haven't worn gloves. For right. No grocery shopping. And I don't know if you've read these articles, but it's racist too. Uh, it doesn't get black people, or it does. It does. Oh. Like disproportionately. Oh, it's a racist virus. What? And sexist too. It, what? it targets males. Shut more up. More than, or so more, like I, males are more susceptible. I'm, the, I'm the most at you, risk. <laughs> yes. 
And now here I am <laughs> because of a racist kissing people the cheek at all <laughs> <laughs> I'm just great to each other with a holy kiss, brother. Yeah, brother, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> what do you, uh, I do want to ask though, uh, how are you staying informed, dude? Like, are you watching news? What are you doing? So, since Kyle, I mean, for a couple years now, I've not had cable yeah. because I've learned that as a luxury that you don't get until you're like 35. Oh my gosh. Uh, I, I, and, my parents yeah. made me give it up at 11. And I was very salty about it, oh, but gosh. it was definitely the right give, choice. Give it up. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. So Dang. Twitter, I mean Yeah. That's but that's where then, I go for news. Did you take your See, bleach shot today? <laughs> did you? Here, I uh yeah. Here's start, the, start the morning with an apple cider the, and the follow uh, it with a bleach. Yeah. To, <laughs> a little Lysol makes Bleed. the medicine go down. Uh, <laughs> but I enjoy I enjoy Twitter. But uh there's just something about reading uh, real news under like a really, really funny tweet. Yeah. yeah. Like you know, that's like fair. a tweet that's like Man, why Clifford the big red dog so big? He's so big. You know what I mean? When, and then after that, you're like seventy thousand people have been infected in you're like bull ga- and you're like, it. oh, gosh. yeah, man, what's man that Clifford tweet. <laughs> I will click on the little why COVID is he that big? Section yeah, of why Twitter. That, that dog too big. Yeah. You know, the, the Twitter has their like the, at the, the news at the top. You click on the COVID right, thing, yeah, yeah. and then there'll be tweets that have like five likes on that, and, and I'm like, like what are you doing? <laughs> I, I I want my news to at least have a thousand retweets. Yeah, yeah. Before I believe. That's well, here's so, a that's so mm-hmm. stupid. Here's a fun fact since y'all are ragging on TikTok. <laughs> All the TikToks that mention coronavirus have like a button attached to the bottom of them. It's like, here are the real facts about COVID-19. Oh, really? You just kind of click on and Nice. Dude, there's one TikTok that I love so much. And I got I to gotta, I gotta show it to you guys. Um, it, is, it is so funny. <laughs> <Flip> <laughs> it's challenge? <laughs> 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 He's it's been holding the, that bit in this whole time. <laughs> it's called the it's called the flim flam. No, no, no. This one is called bacon grease. Oh. Uh, it's called bacon grease. Hold on, I gotta find it, man. I gotta. While, find while it. you're looking, I gotta say, I feel like Bill Hader in SNL this whole time because I've been holding this mic. You know that you know that bit he did where he like put it in their face, but like hit them on the side <laughs> yeah. of the cheek and stuff. Yeah. Um, okay. if, you're, if you're listening, that doesn't make sense. But if you're watching, you know what I'm talking about. Okay, so this is it. And we're going to play it on the screen, too. Okay. Come on. Come on. If you just listen to this podcast, that's that sounds terrifying. <laughs> so, oh, I guess I have to describe... I'm not going to describe <laughs> Go to YouTube and search. You don't deserve... It doesn't deserve to be described. It deserves to be experienced, <laughs> not explained. But uh, it is... Dude, I laugh and cry every time I watch that. It's about a guy frying a piece of bacon and uh, shirtless. <laughs> it really do be like that, though. And, uh, yeah, it, do. Yeah, it, it really do, dude. Um, but man, dude. I mean, is there anything else you wanted to talk about on the show? Dude, I'm just excited to be here. Yeah, legit, man. Um, when do you think it's gonna end? When do you think uh, COVID nineteen is gonna end? Oh, the, not the world. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> you know, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, a couple of weeks ago, this probably wasn't the right uh, answer, but when things got real bad, and I was like, oh, millions of people are losing their jobs, and I lost, you know, some work, and I was telling Grace, I was like, I guess we all just gotta. I don't know. I guess the rapture's gotta happen now. <laughs> I don't know well, why, but I was like, I guess, I guess it's just gotta end. We've had all this, and then we had those tornadoes yeah. the last couple of weeks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then there was like a blood moon at a time. Dude, things, things are tornadoes. Things are hitting, man. Yeah. Uh, there's some another tornado is supposed to be hitting like the upstate tonight. Really? Again. Yeah. Oh gosh. And uh, it really, we really are. Why? You know, it, you know what? It just, <laughs> it just feels like. I don't know, man. It feels like we're just running in the woods of life. Right. And, uh, Why are we? Mother nature. Out? Mother nature <laughs> comes out on a porch <laughs> and cocks a shotgun. <laughs> Since when has this been a tornado area? I don't know. I thought Tor- that was just the Midwest. Tornadoes. This is your vibe check. Go yeah. back out west. Like this yeah. is tornadoes You're are like. Oh, y'all here. in trouble? Oh, <laughs> air- <laughs> tornadoes like. Oh, everybody home. <laughs> it's not good. I, oh my I biked, gosh. Like, Twelve miles this morning, and I saw. I don't know. This. Might I'm be, sorry. What? Um, 
You biked. Yeah, I biked. You rode on a bike. I rode on a bike for twelve miles. Yeah, uh, this I think at like seven a.m. He lives like and, he uh, lives like right off the swamp rabbit. Mm. So you can just it's, hop yeah, on it's it. very easy. For That's me. a lot of miles though. Yeah, I mean, it is. yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but I I I um, rode past. I guess this is from one of the hurricanes or something. Yeah, that happened. A uh, tornado. Oh yeah, but the same. <laughs> it's thing, a whatever. different different. Um, na- I disaster. guess from the cyclone. Uh, <laughs> I, yeah, I saw this garage, like this tree had just fallen on a garage, and I think it was on top of a car. I was like, ah, whoa. Like, is this what we're in oh, for man. now? If this is yeah. going to keep happening? I don't know. Dude. Gosh. <sighs> it's rough. Yeah. Strange times. It's very weird. And I saw nobody out there. I was like, either they don't know about this yet, or this is just like... Th- this is their life now, is they have so, a garage that's you collapsed. Know you know what's funny is... is <laughs> I, I, I enjoy life. I like life. But uh, I like the world. But in a way, <laughs> sometimes, like, watching news and stuff, you're like, I don't know if the world wants us on it. No. <laughs> like, um, I'm like, I think the world's actively fighting us. There's, like, so many things constantly trying to kill you. It's, like, amazing that we get to, you know, just exist. survive just so exist. long. Just <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> Guys, studio's next to a kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> but um, sounds like a smoothie. I don't know, man. What's? Let me ask you this, man. What's keeping you going though, JG? Like, seriously, D- things like this. The yeah. Church I mean, Stories like... podcast. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, I did. This has been your reason not to not to wish for it all to yeah. end. You're welcome. <laughs> It's just two dudes and occasionally a guest rambling. <laughs> and a blender. <laughs> and, a, and, a bl- and a blender. And a baby. And one TikTok. Baby's not in the blender. I okay. <laughs> thought I would note good, that. Good clarification. Yeah. Yes. Um, just, I mean, dude, phone calls, FaceTime, yeah. stuff like that. Um, our pastor's birthday was yesterday, so his wife like organized one of those birthday parade things. Yeah. Everybody like, drove by the house, oh, kind of waved. And, man. Um, dude, I miss it, man. Like, I'm a... I'm a I guess technically I'm an ambivert. I don't know if you've ever heard what of that. that. It's a uh, so like introvert extrovert. Yeah, an ambivert just means you're like a little bit of both. Ah, you're an uh, amphibious vert. Yeah, right. Amphibious. Yeah. <laughs> Land I can and vert sea. in the air and <laughs> underwater. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> I would say I would say I'm the same thing. Yeah. Yeah. Because like I've never heard that term, but I'm that. Yeah. Right. So I I I lean extrovert. Like yeah. I love people, um, but occasionally like I need time to yeah. recharge right right and so Same. like the first couple days it was like oh cool we you know we're working from home like and then like a week went by and i was like this needs to be over like i need <laughs> yeah i don't even care if i know them i just need to go sit in a coffee shop for six hours yeah. with a bunch of other human it's, beings you know it's one of those things that i feel like uh i think we all collectively took for granted yeah uh i, I don't know if it's is it time i don't know if it's community um Freedom. I think we all just took for granted. And that's why we're taking it back. (laughs) Liberate Greenville. Liberate it, guys. I'm here. PD's here. Our leader, (laughs) JG. Our leader, JG. This podcast is brought to you by the protest to open Greenville. We were doing three shots of Lysol in the back, and we are fired up. Uh, But, I mean, yeah, I think the... You know, you really do just kind of hop in a car and go in places. Like, yeah. you, you're like, oh, we can't. That, that is a luxury, right? Yeah, um, that we did not know of until you know now. Yeah, um, right. A um, lot of Netflix. Yeah, a lot of Netflix. A lot of Netflix. And then, like, you see what Netflix is putting out. I was like, you have to pick like your worst, trashiest content <laughs> yeah. to release. Oh, yeah, how for y'all? this time? All right, y'all. Y'all ever heard of a gay zookeeper from Oklahoma, and y'all? Like, the trashiest TV shows. Yeah. Like the, yeah. the reality shows. Yeah. Not good. Like, whatever. But you know what? I know what you're talking world. about. Do you yeah. know what? Do you I know saw what? the trailer for that and I was like, excuse me? Yeah. Like, what? So, like, don't make me unsubscribe. <laughs> Which one? Which one? It was the. I, I don't even. We can't even describe it on the show. Yeah. It's so was bad. it the, no, the, it's, the relationship island yeah. thing? Yeah. Yes. That. Yeah. So, you know, Netflix does not reveal stats. Um. So, I think they know more about us than we know about that's, us. That's you know fair, what I mean? Yeah. So, yeah. they know about people's surfing habits and, like, watching habits and binge mm. habits. So, I think when they put stuff out, like, they don't, they know, they're like, hey, 
hey, we put a bunch of like uh, ripped, chiseled men and women on an island. And you're like, I'm never. That is so ridiculous. And you're like, yeah. oh, 70 percent of our audience watched it all in one sitting. And right. You're like, oh, that's why they keep on making more. It's because they like they know what people are gonna want. I well, guess. that was that was the thing with Tiger King. Was like uh-huh. Stranger Things three was like far and away yeah, the yeah. greatest thing Netflix has dropped to date. And then Tiger King blew it out of the water. Yeah. You know what? I think I've said on the show, imagine being the person to write something really good. You know, I mean, there are right, movies yeah, with like yeah. Oscars, you know, Oscar winning movies on Netflix. Yeah. Imagine working years to try to make and craft and, and you rewrite and then you finally you get it cast and then you get it funded and cast and then you shoot it and then you spend like a year in post production and yeah. editing and then you go to Cannes Film, Film Festival and you go to South by and you do all this thing and you shake hands and you're on a yacht with rich people and then all of a sudden. <laughs> A, a show comes out this is the wildest weirdest show shot over like what a decade or something yeah and immediately it's more talked about rave reviews than anything else right and you're just kind of sitting there in front of your macbook air like time to write another yeah need to write another movie so what like, happened no, with, we uh, know what we want sir you know like, ma'am <laughs> I, I talked about it so much that my girlfriend refused to watch it out of yeah. being annoyed yes. and then eventually she came around yeah and what i found out was it does not hold up on a rewatch because you know how trashy all these right. people are yeah. and how depressing the story actually <laughs> is yeah. and it's not fun to watch again yeah it's a lot of fun to watch the first time so right like, wow but, <laughs> wow then the next time you're like oh man and the, he's gonna he that's oh. another straight guy <laughs> <laughs> like wait what uh man i would like to take this moment to to say that i don't endorse the contents of tiger king but i did watch it uh neither do we <laughs> yeah <laughs> i mean I, yeah we, oh we, sorry it probably goes without being said we but, did do yeah. a podcast about Just it so where clear. you know we were i mean we're very entertained by the situation but sure we, yeah, we definitely yeah. are well aware of how trashy and yeah. not good everybody in the documentary right, is. Right. Yeah. Right, yeah. Except for the campaign, the libertarian campaign manager. He is the one beacon of light in the Tiger King uh, show. He actually is not. <laughs> He's not? <laughs> no, I'll tell did you, you watch uh, Did no. you watch the new episode with no, Joe McHale? I haven't. Yeah, they did like a Zoom you, call Joe you learned, <gasps> you learned some things. Dang it. Yeah. Yeah. So I gotta go watch that after. <laughs> when Nobody's good. No, not no. Nobody. There's no beacon <laughs> no, of light. No. Yep. There's no, no innocent, no. nerdy campaign manager no. who's... Dang it! No, no. He was presented that way. But yeah. You know but. what? You know what? I think. Um, I don't know, man. I think when it comes to content, sometimes I feel very conflicted because I'm like, should we? Should I? Uh, uh, um, you know, it's history. Yeah. <laughs> well, I, I'm a hypocrite like, for trashing the reality TV shows when I just watched all of Love is Blind yeah. with my girlfriend. Love is Blind. And is I hated it the whole time, but I couldn't stop yeah. watching and making fun of everybody who was involved in the show. It is... It is... Uh, it is not good. It was like a cruel experiment when you yeah. got to the last episode. Yeah. Uh, I don't know, man. I, I, I'm always very... I guess people know that reality TV is like, you know, the ticket to fame. Oh, and um, all those people have um, yeah. like amazing followings yeah, now. Like, they're yeah. like, mm, yeah. but, uh, but who knows like how these, long like these last. girls that go on The Bachelor? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Like, they're they not going to win, know, right. but they get yeah. some like crazy endorsement deal. Yeah, or but something. they can sell um, healthy vegan shakes for the rest of their life. Right. right. Yeah. I think the I think the 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 people talk about you know the influencers or or cancer or whatever, but I'm like, dude, uh, until people's uh, desire and ambition for fame. Um, deceases were always there's always going to be that problem you yeah. know like right uh i mean with pd and i talk about that a lot like we we yeah. we create we want to create and we hope that people follow us because we create and if you unfollow us because we didn't put out something for a long time good because you're here you watch <laughs> us to get something from you know what i mean yeah, from yeah. us um, but there is like we were when the, the church that we used to go to there were so many students that were like yeah I just want to be Instagram famous but you're like for nothing what do you what do you do what do you do they're like nah I just I want to take cool pictures we're, t- we're doing a photo shoot this Saturday I want to be Instagram famous I'm like yeah dude shut up sit down <laughs> like do something I've actually had this argument with Lauren she'll be like I want more followers and I'll be like for what 
it's not it really like does not matter it's just like not. easy for you to say <laughs> and i was like they follow me because i do something do something yeah, yeah. That they want to see and on then when you don't do something people are like what else what are you going to do stuff to girls and yeah. you're like i know that's what you know me for and that's what you expect and you are right <laughs> um I don't know. I guess that's just like my big. My but big I was the same exact way. Yeah. Before yeah. I was like, I want followers. I want for, and I wasn't doing any kind of content. I was mm-hmm. just posting pictures of my guitar yeah. or something. <laughs> like, <laughs> I was like, who? Why would yeah. I want a following for this? <laughs> <laughs> I don't. know. I mean, I think it's. But there is. There is this. You know, people have this understanding. Like, there's this like influencer who like threw a chair off of a like a I don't know twentieth story hotel balcony into like the highway and like her boyfriend filmed it and dude she was like surrounded by news cameras because she got arrested and you can tell yeah. she was just like eating it up and uh oh my gosh and it was just one of those things like watching it you're like oh wow you're a terrible person mm-hmm. but you don't know that you are right yeah because you got gosh. what you wanted yeah you know Mm. We're ending it on a serious note. <laughs> I guess since we're no. on the, like the the other side of getting some followers, you realize that it, it doesn't matter really. I don't know, man. No, no. Well, that being said, follow us on Instagram. Yeah, yeah. Let's follow shift. Follow we're gonna follow you. J T A W L L E. This is all just a Shama four reels. Right. Uh, the number four reels with a Z. <laughs> No, but it's good, man. JG, it's really good to have you, man. Yeah, good to be here. Hey, dude, we always really end each this. episode. PD, what's up with your socks, man? Dude, these are You're both, not. These show Christ, the people see it. These people are about the Christmas whole time. socks. Um, you don't have a. You have a they're, Christmas sock. They're, they're, they're inside both out, dude. Socks? One's inside out and one isn't. Um, I is that a bit now? Like, did you do that on purpose? Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but you have the the pairs, like they the yeah. other ones. Oh, okay, okay. But I was like, hey, I mean, they're both Christmas. <laughs> it's April. <laughs> It'll be Christmas again uh, eventually. PD, the fact that you found a woman to accept you for who you are <laughs> is it's a, insane, uh, isn't it's it? It's a it's a it's a miracle. <laughs> <laughs> it's a miracle. Note that's to self: insane. wear mismatching socks yeah. and put one inside. Yeah. yeah, that's that's it. With you just you know, and you you went you just had Chick Fil A with her. Yeah, she yeah. saw this. She let you go out. <laughs> she with didn't Pokemon. leave me. No. <laughs> You That's marry funny. that woman. You got mono. <laughs> yeah. You got mono, and yet she stayed. <laughs> She's with you. Um, hey, this has been good. We end with uh, we end with praise reports, as you know. Um, oh gosh, you got a praise report, PD? Do you have a praise report? Whatever goes first. What? So. Yeah, what uh, praise report is uh, I am a mono survivor. Mm. Mono survivor. I have been advised not to do any strenuous activity mm. for the next six weeks, which I have been ignoring. Yeah, was laughed real hard on this show just now. Yeah. <laughs> That's I strenuous. felt a little lightheaded at one point during this podcast. <laughs> really? It's something I didn't mention. Dude, if you would have passed it out, the, it, was the, it was the flim flam. <laughs> this podcast would have been about, the one about flim flam and PD <laughs> passing out. And I was like, am I just not breathing enough? I think that's when I was laughing a lot. Gosh. Uh, are you going to get like a mono survivor tattoo? Dude, oh, yeah, you should do dude. like the mono, like, never mind. I thought the O's and mono were together so you could do like dude. the circle, like the Moon infinity. Moon mono survivor. <laughs> Like right, like a like a rain, like, you know, like a dip in my mono survivor right yeah. here. Yeah, the dip. Are you gonna do the yeah. rainbow across the chest, or like the, the the gang member one that goes like that? Yeah, you do uh, under yeah. the arm. Yeah, the under under uh-huh. the arm. Yeah, mono survivor. You're at the pool. Like, oh, this old thing. <laughs> 2020. Remember COVID? Mm. Yeah, your boy uh, fought, bought, I almost said bought, <laughs> fought mono. <laughs> there was part of me that really wanted to exaggerate the extent of it. I was like, I'm feeling better, but now I have no excuse to. Stay at home. <laughs> <laughs> you do. A but that's just like virus. global pandemic. That's like I want to do podcasts and yeah, stuff. Yeah. I want to go places. I don't want to. Toyota. Yeah. I don't want to be trapped um, in the house because I'm faking my injury, which is, I was like, I, I would feel like the Steelers quarterback. He, he like, but well, that's a different situation. Ben Roethlisberger, he would like, he would get hurt and then he would like really sell the fact that he was hurt. So yeah. he would look like a hero yeah. when he went in He's the game. He's a big dude too. Yeah. So he'd be like, oh, I don't know if I can play on Sunday. My shoulder's really killing me. And, and then, then he'll, you know. Sunday be like, wow. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And then, he, and then he's a hero. Yeah. But the people have picked up on it. And now oh. it's just kind of like, stop doing that. PD, the hero <laughs> of podcasts. <laughs> <laughs> What's your praise report, JG? Um, I guess it's like a 
I mean, it doesn't sound like much, but I got my Wi-Fi hooked up today. <laughs> yeah, dude, dude, that is a that is a dude, praise and like, that is huge. I mean, working from home, they we called Charter and they were like, "Yeah, we'll send you we'll send you a router. It'll be like five to ten days." And I was like, yeah. "But we're all like working from home right like, now. Sir, and I, I need yeah. internet to yeah. do that." Gosh, man. So, um, yeah, we got, what, what, did we you get like the normal like ninety megabytes? Um, now? I think we got fifty, dude. So I, I think, think it's gonna... like it's like forty. You pay forty five a month. <laughs> Uh, thirty, dude. For uh, sixty-five, you Bump can it get four hundred. Who's listening to this at down. this point? There's like huh? listening to Shama pitch a cable I, package. I was gonna say, to I our know, it's not. It's not cable. I caught a it's glimpse just, of the clock. I mean, not cable. Ago. It's just uh, <laughs> yeah. We ran. We're we, running the clock. We, but no, no, no you can't. You can get four hundred. It's almost like half a gig down, and uh, that junk is uh, speedy. Do wow. you work yeah. for Charter now? No, I'm just uh, <laughs> low key. <laughs> no, no, no. I got it here because my it just I'll just look. Look into it. Yeah. Um, All right. What's my praise report? Um, gosh, man, we we just got a bunch of like new like toys. Yeah. I guess some new equipment, new gear, new mics. Um, <laughs> what you meant for like your your baby? Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> hey, Ed, no, can play with them to- if he wants. No, no he can't. Yeah, they, they double as baby mic, toys. <laughs> what is a baby toy? It's just something they can pick up. I don't. Any dude, pizza is a personal so, pizza if you try hard enough. <laughs> like, <laughs> any toys. Are, yeah, my son, like, I mean, like, yesterday I was in here and he just, I was sitting on the chair over there and he, uh, he was just pushing this office chair around on the floor. Nice. And he was having a ton of fun. And I'm like, that, you go, baby. You found the toy. <laughs> you say that to your child? You I go, say, baby. you go, baby. You go, baby. <laughs> no. <laughs> I say you're acting like a baby a lot. And, uh, unironically, and my wife is like, yes, cause I'm like, oh, no, I just don't want him to act like <laughs> Just don't I just don't like it when he acts like when I'm trying to put him to sleep before y'all came in. When y'all came in, I'm like, yeah. guys, just guys, set up. I'm yeah. like, guys, <laughs> freak. <laughs> Alexa, play worship music. <laughs> <laughs> um, that's me. Yeah. Wow, it's me every day as a responsible dad. I'm sorry, Dude, I love my son. I love my son. Parody. Can I say that? Yeah. The whatever the Alexa or like Echo thing commercial was. Oh my gosh. That it was just like asking. It was like begging to be made fun of. Which one? It was like. Alexa, give me my news rundown. And it was like, the kid was like, Alexa, tell me a joke. Yeah. And then you have to watch it. it, 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 But it was like a minute and a half long. You know I own like seven Alexas here. So I'm like, I got to watch what I say. Bro, you got the wall mount over there? I saw that. Like that's that's next level. And it's like, it doesn't doesn't wake up unless you use the wake up word. How does it hear the wake up word? (laughs) (laughs) Hey, it's a trip, man. It's fun though. I, uh... I set the I got some more last weekend. I set them up, and I was like, I told Grace, I was like, now Jeff Bezos will have no problem spying on us. <laughs> yeah. Also, it's just really dope to be like, hey, turn off the lights. Yeah. Yeah. So I had my wake up where it set to computer at yeah. one point instead of Alexa. Really? And then you people, can change it. Yeah. 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 There's like six different options. Oh, oh, I thought you could like type one in. Uh, no, that would be awesome. I wish. Yeah. Alfred, yeah. like computer. Right. You said computer. <laughs> yeah. Here's it. Computer. Yeah. That is. That is. So G. people would come over and they'd be like, "Hey, Alexa," and I was like, "No, no, you no. Gotta, it's, no like, it's, it's just me. I got to do it." <laughs> computer. computer. Turn on the TV. Right. Yeah. <laughs> That's funny though. We just met. Like we're not on a first name basis. Yeah. Oh, I just took her out of the box. Yeah. So. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this has been a fun episode though. Yeah, this yeah. has been good. Yeah. Thanks for coming on, man. Absolutely. Glad to be here. We videoed it too. We'll put it out tomorrow. Um, <laughs> Talk about turnaround. Yeah, figure it out. <laughs> hey, uh, this has been Church Stories. Flim Flam Challenge. Get on it. <laughs> <laughs> right now, all the kids do the flim. Uh, what is it? What is it? Is it the flim? I don't know. Is it a dance? Is it Turn a dance? To the right I hate shake that flip. There's part Return of me that's still like, this I flip. think this exists. You didn't realize. You're that, <laughs> when you listen to this later, you're going to realize how ridiculous you sound. Dude. Oh, I'm sure it's going to be Try posted online. Convince. There's going to be a clip you're of like, it. You're like, <laughs> you're like, no, search flip flam. I'm like, what are you doing? Pull it up. It's a real thing. Google. No, don't <laughs> search it in TikTok. Google flim flam. Google, you're like, flip flam challenge. I'm like, it's not real, dude. Uh, guys, this, this it's been a tough one though. It's yeah, been good. We'll, uh, we'll reconnect. We'll, we'll reconnect after the world comes back. To yes. Normal, yeah. Right? Like, I don't know. We'll, Let's like, do it. Dude, I'm just after like, I'm going to live in a restaurant liberate. for a long time. We liberate. <laughs> Lead us, JG. We still have that meeting uh, tomorrow night? Yeah, yeah. For the, uh, the liberate, Facebook liberate group. Greenville. <laughs> I'm in a Facebook group called Reopen SC. Legit, it's just memes at this point. Initial was like, guys, let's sign this petition. And right, I was just yeah. like, Karen's when they can't get a haircut. And I'm oh like, my guys, gosh. we've lost our way. Right. <laughs> 
I liked this group of like last Thursday when I joined. It had a purpose, a meaning, a plan. Now I, I know you're trying to land this plane. Yeah. But have you seen the group about where everybody pretends to be ants? Dude, I'm in it. Oh my god. Uh, are you in Will it? Will you add me? There's this, I want to uh, be in it so bad. Dude, <laughs> there's a Facebook group. It's like uh, a group of where we all pretend to be ants. <laughs> And it is the most fun I've ever had. I'm talking, dude. This group got like a million, fo- a million uh, members. Members yeah. within like a week. It's ridiculous. It was nuts. If somebody would post like a picture of a leaf, and I'd be like, guys, I need help. And like everybody would just comment, people comment lift, lift. <laughs> but it's like L space I space F space T. It's like all caps lift. lift. So this is like Reddit level stuff. Dude, on it Facebook. is so funny. Like somebody will be like, somebody take a picture of like a chip on the floor and be like, <laughs> "Guys, I found, I found a morsel." And people will be like, "Munch." <laughs> but it's all capped with like the spaces. Yeah. It is so. It's so oh funny. my god. Slowly munch for t- Yeah, I've never felt <laughs> more disappointed so in my life than when I clicked on like a ten minute video of ants eating a cinnamon roll, <laughs> and I got to the end of the video. Nothing changed. <laughs> you watched 10 minutes of that? I think I just skipped. But Was this recently? No, it was a while ago, but it stuck with me. Yeah. You get, you get real bored on the internet. <laughs> you do particularly. What did you tell me last time? You're like, I just watched people. What did you tell I me last time? I watched Oprah interview a woman with 92 personalities. Yeah. Oh, gosh. She did, did she talk to all 92? I think they like flickered in and out. Huh? <laughs> Pick Guys, your top this is, five. This is uh man, this is this yeah. is it. Gotta, you get a personality. Guys, you this is a free show. This is I just want to remind you, uh, no matter how you feel <laughs> at minute one forty. <laughs> I need more water. Yeah. <laughs> All right. You get just some more water. We only I'll got time for here. two sponsorship ads, so we better wrap yeah. this up. Water. Water. And uh, Dr. TV. Phil thinks it's gonna kill you. <laughs> <laughs> Side effects may include death. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, see you.